hello everybody welcome back to my channel so for this week's video i'm going to be doing the quick fire assumptions video which has been going around i'm pretty sure someone called byron started i love his video well i do it i'm quite interested to see what the questions are what people think of me oh my god i my tampon is really hurting me basically people sent me assumptions and I'm going to be answering them, I'm going to be putting a 10 minute timer on and then answering as many as I can in 10 minutes. Okay, let's get started, I'm kind of scared, kind of expecting- you then, you're not looking at them on your phone. Oh yeah, no. My mum said she's going to be asking me the question. I was going to say I'm scared about what people think of me, but I think I already know what people think of me. Okay, so 10 minutes on the timer, I'm not going to edit anything from this point on. I'm scared of that, but anyway, yeah. 10 minutes, let's go, right, go. You're very picky when it comes to boys. Um, yes, but also no, like, I definitely have a type and it definitely takes a lot to, like, amuse me, I guess. I don't know how to explain it. Like, yeah, I guess I am, yeah. You wished you lived in a hot country. Oh my god, yes. I, w I hate living in England, like, I really don't like it. I want to live in, like, Hawaii or, like, some tropical island where I can always have a tan and just always be in the sea. Because the sun makes me happy and England's fucking boring. You're a lightweight when it comes to drinking. Yeah, I'm such a lightweight. I can literally have like one drink and like be gone. Like it's it's kind of embarrassing, but also I like it because I don't have to spend loads of money and be really bloated. I can just have one drink and like be fine. So <laughs> you're a dramatic person. I mean, obviously, like it's quite clear to see, isn't it? Um, that's why I want to be an actress. I guess it will. You don't care what people think of you. Um, no, I don't, but also a little bit. Like, I don't like the fact most people, well, most people that I've spoken to have, like, a bad image of me when they first see me. They think I'm, like, really bitchy and horrible, and I'm just like, no, I'm, like, not. Um, but no, I don't really care what people think of me in terms of, like, what I wear and how I act. Like, I'm me, and if they have an issue with that, then I don't really want them in my life. You want more piercings? Uh, yeah, I definitely want more piercings. I was thinking about getting my nipple pierced, but I'm not too sure, like, I've heard lots of people saying, like, bad things about the aftercare and it getting caught and things, I'm not sure about that. But I definitely want my nose pierced, um, after lockdown. Maybe some more ear piercings, but yeah, I definitely want more piercings. I love them. You're a smoker. Absolutely not. If you know me, you know I do not smoke, and I've never smoked in my life, and I would never. I don't have any problems if you do it personally i just don't like it and also have asthma and it makes me cough whenever i can smell smoke and i just don't really see the attraction to it to be honest um no just not really my thing you're very confident um yeah definitely i i'm definitely a confident person i don't really care um and yeah I, I'm, I'm quite confident but also I do have days where I don't feel good about myself and I feel insecure, so I'm not always confident, but for the most part, yeah. You've never been in love? Um, I think I have. I mean, what I think of love, mm, yes. But then I don't know. I'd, I'm unsure. I think so, but then, I don't know, maybe, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, I think I have. You struggle with your mental health? Um, yes, at the moment, especially being in lockdown, like it's really taken a toll on it. And I went to see some friends today actually, and it's literally put me in like such a good mood. And like whenever I talk to people after I've seen other people, they're like, Jess, you seem so much happier. And I'm like, yes, I am, because I can go out and socialize. Um, but yeah, like generally, not really that much. Like my MS phobia and everything is so much better than it used to be. Um, but yeah, I have struggled in the past and I am struggling a bit at the moment, but for the most part, I'm doing, I'm doing alright. You've never had a one night stand? No, I mean, I'm not opposed to one. <laughs> I'm not like opposed to one and I don't judge if anyone has loads. Um, I just haven't really been in that situation and I mean, I don't know if I would actually, like, I don't know if I could meet someone that night and then, do you know what I mean? Um, so no, I haven't. <laughs> You were rebellious at school. Um, yeah, I think so. Like, in primary school, I was always getting told off and always talking, and every parent's evening would be like, Jess talks too much. If she worked harder, she'd do better. Um, and I literally had, like, a spot in, like, primary school that I had to sit on because I'd distract everyone. And that's happened through, you know, secondary school <laughs> and college. But no, college, I actually am quite well behaved. I just missed a lot of sociology lessons because I couldn't be bothered and drove home. You overthink things. 
Uh, yes, I literally am such an overthinker. I overthink literally everything. Um, and it's not good because it makes me just not... It just It's just not good, is it? But yeah, I definitely overthink a lot of things. Um, which I kind of hate. I would change that about myself if I could. Let me just check the time. Okay, six minutes. We're on six minutes. No, no we've got like five minutes left. -ish. You've never had a boyfriend and don't really talk to boys. I have had a boyfriend. Um, and I definitely do talk to boys. Um, I, yeah, I talk to boys, like, boys from my college, boys on f Tinder, um, yeah, nothing really, like, comes from it, but it's just a bit of fun, really, isn't it? And yeah, I have had a boyfriend. You earn <laughs> only loads, one, only one. You earn loads of money. Um, I wouldn't say, like, loads, I'd say, like, a good amount for my age, but, yeah, like, I don't really know, like, whatever you class as loads, like, that's kind of your own sort of, what's the word? Like, that's that's for you. Like, you might think something's a lot, someone else might not. Does that make sense? Yeah. I earn, like, a good amount, I'd say, yeah. You want kids? Yeah. I used to want, like, six. I'll tell you for why, because I used to play The Sims and make really big families, and I was like, oh, this, sound, this seems so fun, like, having loads of children, like, giving them different names, and then giving them different personalities, and then I realised that's not really how it works. <laughs> um, so yeah, I definitely do want kids, probably like two or three. Definitely not six, that's a bit much. You have kissed more than five guys. Um, I think I've kissed five guys, not more than five. Is that bad? No. You're a badass bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Hate that. Um, sure, if that's what someone thinks about me, sure. Your snap score is over 500,000. Can I quickly check? Um, I don't know. I am on Snapchat a lot and I've had it for a really long time, so probably, yeah. I don't even know what um, that is. Yeah, it's seven, seven, over 700,000. I don't know if that's good. Like, what does it even mean? I don't know. But yeah, I'm on Snapchat all the time, so. You're quite kind and caring. I am! I don't know why everyone thinks I'm, like, this horrible person. Don't you think I'm kind? Like... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I am always there for my friends. I'm always making sure people are okay. And yeah, like I always go out of my way to make sure my friends are okay and uh, I want to make them happy. And yeah, I'm definitely kind and caring when I when I want to be. <laughs> You've done drugs before? Absolutely not. And I would tell you if I had. I'm very open about stuff like that, especially with my mum. Um, I've never done drugs. Not opposed to doing drugs. I mean, like, not any hard drugs. Like, I would try weed, probably. Um, because I'm such like an anxious person, I don't know, maybe it'll make me a bit more, you know, relaxed. But no, I've never done drugs and I wouldn't do anything other than weed because that shit scares me. Even weed scares me, which is why I haven't tried it at the moment. You get hate for doing YouTube. Um, yeah, but no. Like, I used to get quite a lot of hate, like people used to not bully me, but just make fun of it because my YouTube channel name also used to be Galaxy Teen. If you've been there since then, then you're a real one, but um, yeah, I used to be made fun of a bit for that. And people don't really make fun of me now. They kind of think it's quite cool, which I like. So, but yeah, I still do have the occasional, like, comment made about it, which is a bit annoying. But at the end of the day, I don't really care because I'm having fun, so. You're very direct and upfront if you have a problem with someone. Yeah, definitely. Like, if I've got an issue, I'll tell someone because that's the only way things can really get resolved. If you hold in how you're feeling, things won't really nothing will really happen from that, I'm definitely, not in like an aggressive way, like I, I actually hate confrontation, but I definitely would tell someone if there was an issue and try and resolve it in like a mature way. <laughs> you hate your nose and would consider a nose job. Oh my god, that's a bit rude. <laughs> um, I don't hate my nose, no. Would I like it to be a bit smaller? Yes, it's more so from the side, I don't like it. Also, my nostrils are actually enormous. Um, no, I'm not really insecure about it and I definitely would never have a nose job. I probably would never have plastic surgery full stop because I'm I'm quite content in myself. Um, but yeah, like, I guess if people point it out then it's a bit like, oh, I didn't realise it was that big. But no, I'm not really that insecure. And it's not, like, it, it's, it's me. Do you know what I mean? If I change my nose, that's part of me gone. So no, I'm not really that insecure about my nose. That's similar to the next question. You would Got get you want plastic surgery. No. I no, like I don't know, like what plastic surgery would I get? Like maybe I'd I'd wanna try lip fillers but not actually get them if that makes sense. Like I'd wanna see what they'd look like 
with lip fillers. Without actually getting them. Yeah, without actually, because like, whenever I smell my top lip disappears, which I kind of hate, but apart from that, I don't want plastic surgery, no. I'm happy in myself. You want to do YouTube as a full-time career? Absolutely not. Um, not that I don't like YouTube most of the time, let's see. Um, 30 seconds, okay. Um, I'll end on this question. So yeah, I don't want to do YouTube full-time. I love doing it. It's really fun. I'm definitely going to carry on doing it at uni. Um, but I don't want to do it as a full-time career, no. But if it helps me get to where I want to be, then brilliant. Um, but my full-time career, hopefully what I want to do is be an actress. Obviously, you know, that might not happen. Um, but that's currently where I'm at, what I want to do. If not that, something to do with film or TV, something to do with fashion, something along those lines. Um, okay, that's the time. Yes! Is that all the questions? Yeah, I did a couple in at the end. <laughs> My mum just making them up. Okay, my battery is flashing. I've been like scared the whole time that it's gonna run out. That's the end of this week's video. That was quite intense. I like that though. You did good. I did do good. What can I say? If you guys did enjoy this video, give it a big thumbs up, comment, subscribe, all of that. So I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys on Wednesday for a new vlog. Bye. <laughs> okay, bye.